wanted to show you guys some of the cool looking ball pythons we have here at Safari Reptiles and uh, two of these snakes we actually just got in and they're really neat looking so first up here we have a female Mojave spot nose yellow belly we got this girl from Don Patterson over there in BC British Columbia and uh, this is a really beautiful snake and I don't know if the colors are gonna show up on the camera but this snake has just amazing blushing along the sides and um, the yellow is not exactly popping on camera like it would be in person snake is actually a lot more yellow at least right now in person but really cool golden head really nice looking female and of course a bunch of nice stuff you can make with that um, we have a special ball python which as you guys may or may not know when combined with Mojave it will make crystals so that's really cool let's put her back and we have another cool animal here that we got from Don and that is a Tofino now for those of you who have never seen one of these before you may think it just looks like a regular albino or maybe you think it looks a little bit like lavender albino because it is a little bit more purple than your regular um, albinos but this is actually a Tofino. Uh, Tofino is a recessive gene and it seems to work with the toffee gene. Um, I suggest if you guys haven't seen a toffee ball python that you guys look it up. Really cool looking but we find the to uh, the Tofino actually looks better than both the uh, albino or the toffee and there are a couple people who find these guys actually look even better than lavender albinos so really cool looking snake and uh, this snake's color is actually coming out really good from what I could see on camera uh, kind of orangey right now and the purple really pops so this little guy is a male now we're going to look at some of the animals that you guys have seen already, but I just want to update you on how they are progressing. This snake over here well, is our very mean orange dream bumblebee ball python. And uh, he loves to snap. And you guys can see the orange dream influence is starting to come out on his sides. And uh, yeah, he's a very mean boy. But, um, you know, when we first got him, he looked like just your average bumblebee but as he has uh, grown and shed that orange has come out more and more along his sides so kind of excited to have him he's our only orange dream thing in our collection um, I guess I'll show you guys this female I actually really like this female when I had first shown you guys her a lot of people had told me well deserts don't breed this and that female desert useless well this um, female ball python you're looking at right here is a desert, but it's a desert ghost, which is a recessive uh, gene. And basically, as you guys can see, there's only one gene uh, in play here, the desert ghost gene, and it really just brightens up the animal. Really like a, a nice gene when combined with, uh, let's say, uh, lemon blasts and things like that actually probably the nicest thing that you could do with a desert ghost is put it to a lemon blast they look quite incredible especially as adults and they actually fade even more as they get older this snake will basically end up being uh, white and that's basically where they get their name from desert ghost because it looks like desert ghost camo um, I guess next we'll look at our pastel puma here she is uh, still doesn't look all that special but I really like this snake because she fed very quickly on frozen rodents and she's been growing like a beast as you guys can see and then one of our males from last year that we produced that just recently shed this is gonna be one of our all-star males especially going forward because as you guys know we have a lot of orange ghost things this is our orange ghost black pastel butter very very nice looking male I love how he kind of has like a faded kind of blue color on top of his eyes very very pretty snake uh, great snake eats very very well and uh, we actually 
traded his sister and a couple of his siblings for the snake I'm about to show you guys next. And since we're getting right around the five minute mark, we're gonna end the video off with her. And again, we traded a bunch of really nice looking animals for this girl, but honestly, this is probably my favorite ball python. She blows them all away. And that is the banana fire spider. And she's actually freshly shed. And you guys could just see the color is really incredible. Um, this snake is actually glowing in person. I don't know if you could kind of see it here, but uh, it's insane. Like this snake, every time I open the bin up and I see her progressing, I see more of those black dots coming in. I see her actually getting brighter and lighter with each shed. I'm just more and more amazed. And this snake is an awesome eater. And the guy we actually got the snake off of, usually when we do get animals from him, it takes him a little while for them to jump onto the frozen thawed. But she jumped onto frozen thawed right away. So she's, she's just, if I'm honest with you, this is my perfect snake. Um, I'm a big, big fan of yellow snakes. As you guys know, I used to have a bunch of carpet pythons, really like jungles, jaguars, things like that. Um, and just the fact that it has this like unreal patterning on it is really cool. And like I said, it's not just the way she looks. It's not just that she's a quote unquote genetic powerhouse, but it's also just because of the way she acts. You guys could see she's really, could, sh eh, could see she is really easy to handle and uh, really friendly and she eats like a monster uh, open her bin and she's ready but she's never been me really friendly snake my favorite snake the banana fire spider hope you guys enjoyed the video if you guys have any I uh, any other ideas for videos you'd like to see please leave them in the comment section down below Please subscribe and all that fun stuff And uh, if you have any questions on any of the animals you see in my videos, please don't hesitate to ask Thanks and have a great day morning and night